Hello and welcome. Of all the different mounts on a vehicle, the most attention is given to the engine and transmission mounts. Why? Because they go bad most of the time. Mounts are nothing more than a component that secures one item to another. You may ask, isn't a mount merely a bracket? Well, yes, but a mount is able to prevent vibration transfer between the two components. In the case of an engine or transmission mount, they isolate vibration transfer to the vehicle frame. So why do they fail? Age is certainly a component. Rubber weakens with age. Now think of the force that is exerted on an engine mount every time you accelerate. The rubber insulators endure this over and over again thousands of times. Sometimes the rubber tears or separates from one of the metal plates that it is bonded to. Some mounts may not tear or separate, but the rubber can shrink or become distorted, allowing for excessive movement. It's all just about age and use. Contamination leads to failures. Rubber and oil do not like each other much. Oil degrades the rubber, causing it to soften and swell. Oil contamination is common on engine or transmission mounts due to the engine or transmission leaks. Abuse can also be a factor. Engine and transmission mounts are designed to withstand the normal use of a vehicle. Abuse comes from repeated hard acceleration. Power braking is another example of abuse. If a vehicle is modified to increase the power beyond what the mounts were designed to handle, they can quickly fail. To combat this problem, many solutions have been used over the years to limit engine movement. A common old school trick was to install a chain between the engine block and the frame. And yes, we all did it as silly as it might have looked. Racers look to solid engine mounts or engine plates to keep all that horsepower in check. Polyurethane offers an in-between solution. Polyurethane is stronger than rubber and can handle more abuse, making these types of mounts very common for performance applications. But they don't dampen vibration as well, so be prepared to sacrifice comfort. Misalignment is a common but often overlooked cause for failures. Every mount has a specific procedure that should be followed for installation, allowing it to sit in its natural state. When these procedures aren't followed, a mount can end up twisted or distorted, which will lead to premature failure. Active engine mounts are any that can vary the amount of dampening they provide. These utilize hydraulic fluid and either electric or vacuum controls. Aging causes rubber to crack, allowing the hydraulic fluid to leak out. But problems with the vacuum or electric controls can also be the culprit. Mounts do a lot, plus they are a safety feature. Be sure to suggest them to your customers when they are working on any engine or transmission removal. Thanks for being with us and have a great day.